What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Elder Scrolls 5 Skyrim video here for you guys on the channel. So in the previous video we actually ended up starting the Dawnguard DLC by coming into this cave section and I guess indirectly having to save Serana which is right here. She's one of the better companions in my personal opinion in this game. However, she's limited by a couple things, like for one, she's a vampire, of course. Uh, she is romanceable, but uh, again, she is limited. There is a way that you can make her into not a vampire, but I'm not going to spoil that in this video, so yeah. If you're excited for this video though, as we are going to be continuing on with this DLC, do me a huge favor drop a like on this video also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow so with that being said let's just jump right into this all right so something i think we gotta do i think we gotta send her home so let's go ahead well not send her home we have to lead her home so all right it's over here oh cool we've already discovered the northern keep um i totally forgot that we had to come here for a previous mission a main quest i believe maybe i don't remember but we had to come here to save somebody, and long story short, we already did that, so this place has already been discovered. So, it is very simple to get to our destination. Come on, Serana. Oh, Nern Root. Give it to me. Alright. Serana, you better be on my... Hey, it's a snow wolf. That's actually pretty cool. But aren't they vampires? Can't they just turn into bats? <laughs> Alright, travel to Castle Volkahar. Let's go to Volkahar then. Castle Volkahar discovered. Man, this place is huge. Oh, by the way, hold on. Uh, Alright, no, let's not do that. Man, I forget. There we go. You can actually shoot these guys down, I think. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and they have uh, something cool on them. Like bird bones. Look at that. You can actually make necklace out of those. That's actually really cool. I, I really... I remember when they added this into the game. I was like... Stunned, essentially. Because that's such a cool thing to add into the game. More crafting stuff, you know? Alright. Hello? Hey, what's up, bro? Can I come in? Go away. Shut you up. Suffer trespassers. Go away. Okay, so before we go in there. Uh-huh. Uh what is it? I wanted to thank you for getting me this far. But after we get in there, I'm going to go my own way for a while. I think. I know your friends would probably want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. Okay. Open the gate. Jizargo and Dog, you guys better protect me. Are you gonna do anything, Serana? Get out of the way, Bone Wolf. Alright, screw it. Come on. So... She's not gonna talk? Oh, there we go. Okay, whatever. Let's just go inside. I thought they were gonna have a conversation, but apparently I'm pretty psychotic because I it didn't happen. Oh, well. How dare you trespass here? Wait. Serana? Is that truly you? I cannot believe my eyes. Man, their eyes are insane. And I'm not gonna lie to you, dude. She is... My Lord, she's gorgeous. Serana has returned. I guess I'm expected. I can't believe it. Oh, God. Alright, speak to Harkon. Look at all this. This is my absolutely long disgusting. Lost daughter returns at last. I trust you have my Elder Scroll. I 
After all these years, that's the first thing you ask me? Of course. Yes, I have the scroll. Of course, I'm delighted to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words aloud? Yep. Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Wow. Now tell me, who is this stranger you have brought into our hall? Nobody important. This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? John Travolta. I mean Lucius Invictus. Who are you? I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter would have told you what we are. I mean, it's pretty obvious. Uh... You're vampires. Not just vampires. We are among the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim. Gasp! For centuries we lived here, far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. Uh... So what happens now? You have done me a great service, and now you must be rewarded. There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach and you will never fear death again. Uh, I'm a werewolf. What happens if I accept your gift? Yes, I can smell it on you. The power of my blood will purge that filth and make you whole again. And what if I want to remain a werewolf? I will banish you from this castle. I will spare your life this once, but after that, you are prey. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! Oh, power snap! That I offer. Now, make your choice. Man, he looks so freaking cool, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Um... This is a tough one. I, uh, I'm gonna refuse. I, I like being a werewolf. So be it. You are prey, like all mortals. I banish you. No, Monica! <clears throat> Whoop. So much for that. Hey, what's up, Jazargo? I haven't seen you in, uh, like 10 seconds. You know, for being banished, we literally just came right outside the door. Alright, so what's the mission? Uh, speak with Isran. Alright, you know what? I think I could just fast travel straight there from here. So I'm gonna do that instead of... Getting on the boat. Oh my god, controllers suck sometimes. Look at the Charis or Charis or I don't even know how to say that to be honest. Alright. I still think this place is gorgeous, I'm not gonna lie. Right in the booty. <laughs> Let's see if I can get that arrow back. Let's go. Alright. We gotta talk to Isran though. He's gonna be pretty upset that I didn't kill the vampires. But on my defense, they're pretty powerful vampires. Hey, who's this? Hello, Vori. Yes? No? Need something? Okay, whatever. Never mind. I thought you had dialogue for me. But no, I can see that you uh, can care less. Hey, this this wasn't here. It's getting built up now. Oh no. What was that sound? Oh no! Let's go! What's up? Oh 
Oh, damn. Who did that? Oh, was it my companion? I'll be taking that. Do I have this color? Let me see. I gotta go down to vampire armor. Yes, I do. I think there's only three colors, and I think I might already have it all. And I do have boots, I just don't have the the gloves. Isran, come here. Look at this. I should have known it was only a matter of time before they found us. It's the price we pay for openly recruiting. We'll have to step up our defenses. I don't suppose you have some good news for me. Nope. <laughs> I mean, I have news, but I wouldn't necessarily call it good. Of course. Why did I suppose differently? Fine. Tell me what you know. So, uh... The vampire menace was looking for a specific woman that was trapped in Dim Hollow. And I kind of rescued her and sent her home. The woman? Trapped in there? That doesn't make any sense. Who is she? More importantly, where is she? Well, it's like I said, I sent her home. Uh, but she's the daughter of a powerful vampire lord. And so you deliver her to them. Yes. They also have an Elder Scroll. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. They what? And you didn't stop them? You didn't secure the scroll? Okay, so first of all, how did you, ex how do you expect me, by myself, and Jazargo, and a dead dog, to basically fight against an entire clan of vampire lords. I'm lucky to have made it out alive. Right. So they have this woman and an Elder Scroll by the Divines. This couldn't get much worse. This is more than you and I can handle. Exactly. So... We have to do something, right? Well, of course we do. I'm old. Not stupid. We're just going to need some help. From? If they're bold enough to attack us here, then this may be bigger than I thought. I have good men here, but... There are people I've met and worked with over the years. We need their skills, their talents, if we're going to survive this. If you can find them, we might have a chance. Well, who are they and where can I find these people we need? Right to the point, aren't you? Duh. I like that. Not like those fools in the Order. We should keep it small. Too many people and we'll draw unwanted attention to ourselves. I think we'll want Serene Gerard. Breton girl, whip smart and good with tinkering. Fascination with the Dwemer. Weapons in particular. Last I knew, she was out in the Reach. Convinced she was about to find the biggest dwarven ruins yet. Uh... So she'll help us? Might need a little convincing. But she should. You'll also want to find Gunmar. Big brute of a Nord. Hates vampires almost as much as I do. Got it into his head years back that his experience with animals would help. Trolls in particular, from what I hear. Last I knew he was out scouring Skyrim for more beasts to tame. Bring the two of them back here, and we can get started on coming up with a plan. Um... Uh, all right, let's Watch go get map. some people. All right, map. We gotta go get Serene Gerard and Gunmar. Let's see. I don't remember where they're at, so I'm just gonna follow this. Who's this guy? Serene Gerard. All right, let's go to. Crap, that's such a terrible spot too. I don't think I have another choice. But to go to Northern Keep or Northwatch Keep again. And make my way south to him. Hold on, let me see. Where's this other guy? Gunmar. Maybe I could get him easily. Wait, hold on. Where did the marker go? Oh, it's right here. Well, this one might be easier if I go to Helgen, right? And it's closer. So let's go here. We'll do this one first. And then we'll rescue Serene afterwards. After we get Gunmar. So we gotta go southwest. Oh, crap. Alright, so north. Southwest, so it should be. 
Oh, that's not good. Can I even go in here? This is where we started the game, by the way. It's locked. Can we go around? There's definitely people inside there, so I wouldn't be surprised if it's like bandits or something. Alright. So we're definitely went around. Let's go ahead and keep our weapons out just in case someone wants to get froggy. Um you never know. Go, jump! Let's not get ourselves killed though. Oh that was close. I think we've are I think we're already here. Um It's right around here somewhere. You can see it on the map. Uh, okay. I hear something. Oh no, some wolves. Cool. It's a stray dog. Hi, doggy. Uh, it's time for you to go back home, dog. Wait, can I, can I adopt this dog? Your pet heads back. Oh, cool. We got a, we got another dog. Jazargo, you be nice. You look ready to fight this dog. Alright, you're not gonna attack my dog. I know you're a cat, but still. Come on, Jazargo. Alright, let's go. Um, Shouldn't there be somebody around here? There he is. Is this him? Good mark. You there. Hold fast. Shut I'll up. I'll this damned bear for two weeks. I'll not let it have any more victims. Uh, so, quickly. Isra needs your help, though. Isra needing someone else's help? Yep. Never thought I'd hear that. I'm afraid he's a few years too late. I've moved on. I have more important business to attend to. Did you guys date? Besides, he can handle anything alone. He assured me so himself. What could he possibly need my help with? Well, funny story, um, we're actually up against some very powerful vampires. Vampires? That's, That's correct. Well, that might change things. Tell me more about what's going on. Uh, we're not entirely sure, but one thing that is for sure is that they have an Elder Scroll. By the eight. Alright, look. I'll consider it. But I can't just leave this bear to prey on more innocent people. Once it's dealt with, then perhaps I'll see what Isran expects of me. Alright. Well, let's go defeat him. Don't worry. We got this together. By the power of our combined powers. Oh, snap! What in the world just happened? <laughs> She literally Is he dead? You are taking us somewhere warm, I trust. <laughs> Jazargo needs to get the hell up. I don't know what, what happened there, but uh, whatever. Look, it's a dead orc. Uh I don't want to read that, so I'm not gonna worry about it. I'll take that though, and this for selling. Is Jazargo stealing? <laughs> oh my god, that is hilarious. Jazargo, get out of my way, bro. Oh snap, there's two of them. Let's go! I think we're gonna be able to kill one of them. There we go. Sit down! I'm gonna kill this. There we go. Look at me. I'm all powerful. Gunmar. Oh, now you wanna get up, Jazargo? Don't know how well I'd have managed by myself. You have my thanks. You've helped me. So I suppose the least I can do is find out what Isran wants. 
be still at that fort near Stendar's beacon, I assume. That is correct. Uh... Yes, he said to meet him at Fort Dongard. Of course he did. He's been working on that place for years now. Never lets anyone in. His own little fortress. Well, I guess I'll get to see what he's been up to all this time. I'll meet you there. Cool. We got Gunmar, so now let's go get Sor Sorin? I want that. And that. 11 gold, that's it? Alright, whatever. I guess it's better than nothing, I suppose. Alright. Let's go fast travel. Now we gotta go way back up there again. And figure out a way to get to Serene. Luckily, there's only one more arrow on the map. So, I should be able to just go there and see what's up. Alright, Jazargo, you ready? I guess we gotta go on a cold swim. Let's go. Get out of the way. No, no. I legit hate the sound of Nern Roots. Fun fact. Uh, can I climb all the way up here? Let's find out. I mean, it's Skyrim, right? It's Elder Scrolls. I should be able to just zigzag my way all the way up to the top of the mountain. Let's go. Well, I think we've reached our match. Let's go. You know what? I don't want to... I don't want to do this. Alright, we got to fight. Oh, God. Oh, actually, I think I found the way. No. Well, that's a fail. Oh, that's a very big fail. Eh, I guess it wasn't that bad. Oh, snap. It's a horker. Or whatever it's called. Yeah, Horker. I'll let Jazargo take care of him. Or not. Let's go. Almost there. Are you gonna work or what? I wanna see Jazargo finish the job. Are you not gonna fight him? It's about time. Look at Jazargo go. Good job, Jazargo. I'm proud of you. Only the greatest companion ever. I wonder how far the I have to go for this. If I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure it's outside of the snowy area. And if that's the case, I think I got a long way to go. I gotta go on a long trek just to find Serene. I mean, I could always cheat, right? Nah, I'm not gonna do that. Not this time around. Oh, no. Okay, screw it. Time to fly. I just want to go up there. Just to make it faster on the video. Because I... It'll probably take like 20 minutes in itself just to get around this mountain. So we gotta fly. And of course I can't go that way. So then let's go this way. Gotta love those invisible walls, right? Man, that's crazy that I know how to fly. Who could have ever saw this coming? I'm gonna just go continue going. Wait a minute. Let's just discover this. Okay, this is one of those orc strongholds. Where in the world... Alright, I'm not entirely sure. I suppose we'll discover this mountain as well. 
or cave, I should say. You know what? I think, I think this is all right. We'll we'll get out of clipping right here. Let's go. Actually, you know what? I'll quick save because uh, the game loves to crash on me sometimes. Let's go. Should be actually. I think we're here. I clipped my way here. <laughs> oh well, don't judge me. All right. Hey, Serene. Hello. You haven't seen a sack full of dwarven gyros lying around, have you? I mean, I've I seen a sack. I left it right here. Do you think um, mud crabs might have taken it? I saw one the other day. Wouldn't be surprised if it followed me here. That's kind of a dumb thing to say. Around, will you? So before I do that, uh, you remember Isran, right? He actually asked me to come find you. Isran wants me. Oh, he wants you, all right. No, you must be mistaken. He made it exceedingly clear the last time we spoke that he had no interest in my help. I find it hard to believe he's changed his mind. He said some very hurtful things to me before I left. Anyway, I'm quite happy in my current pursuits. So if you'll excuse me. Well, it's crazy. You, wait, you had a falling out? Yes, that was my point. I felt it was rather clear. But why, though? What is it you want from me? <clears throat> Alright, look. I don't know how important this is to you, but it is very important. But vampires now threaten all of Skyrim. That's why he needs your help. Vampires? Really? Yes, absolutely. Oh, and I suppose now he remembers that I proposed no less than three different scenarios that involved vampires overrunning the population. Well, what are they up to? <laughs> Fun fact. Uh, they have an Elder Scroll. I... well, that's actually something I never would have anticipated. Interesting. I'm not sure what they would do with one, but in this case, Isran is probably correct in thinking it isn't good. All right. If nothing else, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to learn more about what's going on so I can better defend myself. Absolutely. But I'm not just going to abandon what I've been working on here. It's too useful. I need at least one intact dwarven gyro. So either I need to find the satchel those mud crabs stole, or I need another gyro from someplace. You wouldn't happen to have one, would you? Um. Here, I got one. Take it. Thank you. It's not much, but this will help a great deal with some things I've been researching. Not gonna lie. No. I didn't know I had one. Where expect me to go? What do you think of? Uh, what do you think? Fort Dongard. Been working more on his secret hideout, has he? Duh. It'll be interesting to see how much progress he's made. I'll finish up here and head in that direction as soon as I can. See you there. Awesome. So, if you guys wanted to know where the sack is, it's actually by the river. Right there. You got the, gy the gyros right there. It's that simple. It's by the river. I guess she was right in her assessment that uh, mud crab stole her stuff, right? All right, let's go ahead and go back to Isran. It's a lot of going back and forth, isn't it? All right. There should be a lot more like, it should be a lot more built up this time around. I think every time we pu uh, complete a part of the quest or of the story, it, it builds up more. Yeah, see? These things, I don't... Yeah, okay, look. Now they have an entrance. Tell me that's not badass. I love it. Is this a new character? Let me see. You, guard. I hope the vampires try to attack us. I... I... Alright. I don't care. Let's go. She has no dialogue. It was new. At least, uh... At least I haven't seen her before. In this playthrough, so... 
She's gotta be new. Man, playing through this game again really makes me hype for uh, Elder Scrolls 6, man. One day, right? One day. It's only a matter of time. Fort Dongard. Alright, let's see. Oh, snap! Alright, Isra. You've got us all here. Now, what do you want? Hold it right there! What is this what about? Doing? Making sure you're not vampires. Can't be too careful. So, welcome to Fort Dawnguard. I'm sure you've heard a bit of what we're up against. Powerful vampires, unlike anything we've seen before. And they have an Elder Scroll. If anyone is going to stand in their way, it's, it's gonna, gonna be, be me. Us. This is all well and good, but do we actually know anything about what they're doing? What do we do now? We'll get to that. For now, get acquainted with the space. Soreen, you'll find room to start your tinkering on that crossbow design you've been working on. Gunmar, there's an area large enough for you to pen up some trolls. Get them armored up and ready for use. In the meantime, we're going to get to the bottom of why a vampire showed up here looking for you. Wait, what? Let's go have a little chat with it, shall we? Um, and you didn't kill it? Let's see what they have to say. Here we are. It begins again. I fear for what is to come. Um... So it looks like I could buy an armored troll. All right, what about you? Well, this isn't exactly a palace, is it? Still, it's sturdy, secure, and seems defensible. I suppose I'd rather be here than most other places in Skyrim. Isran needs me. It must be pretty bad. Agreed. I wonder what we're up against here. They just... They, we, you already know, it's vampires. Uh... I... Guess... All right, whatever, let's go. Right, let's find out what vampire showed up here. Um, I don't remember how to get up there. I think it's this way. Or maybe it just doesn't matter. I don't know. Hello. Hey, wait, where are you going? Gasp! What are you doing here? This vampire showed up while you were away. I'm guessing it's the one you found in Dim Hollow Crypt. Says it's got something really important to say to you. So let's hear it. Um... Some privacy, please? You probably weren't expecting to see me again. No, not really. Well, yes. <laughs> what are you doing here anyways? I'd rather not be here either, but I needed to talk to you. It's important, so please just listen before your friend here loses his patience. It's... Well, it's about me and the Elder Scroll that was buried with me. Um... So, what about you? The reason I was down there and why I had the Elder Scroll. It all comes back to my father. I'm guessing you figured this part out already, but my father's not exactly a good person. What? Even by no way. Standards. He wasn't always like that, though. There was... a turn. He stumbled onto this obscure prophecy and just kind of lost himself in it. Uh... What sort of prophecy exactly are we talking about here? It's pointless and vague, like all prophecies. The part he latched onto said that vampires would no longer need to fear the sun. That's what he's after. He wants to control the sun. Have vampires control the world. Anyway, my mother and I didn't feel like inviting a war with all of Tamriel, so we tried to stop him. That's why I was sealed away with the scroll. So what does this have to do? Uh, I mean, you took a big risk to come here. I did, but something about you makes me think I can trust you. That's right. I don't... hope I'm not wrong. Uh, no, you're right. Uh, we just have to convince the others uh, that you're on our side. Well, let's move then. I'm nothing if not persuasive. So, Isran, fun fact. All right, she's not bad. What it has to say. Now tell me, is there any reason I shouldn't kill this blood-sucking fiend right now? 
Um. So set your hatred aside, man. There is a bigger picture, and you absolutely need to see this. Set my hatred aside. Not a chance. It's what keeps me strong. Or narrow-minded and let us let you see what else there is in this fight. You don't trust her? Fine. Trust me. I believe her. You better know what you're doing. I do. It can stay for now. But if it so much as lays a finger on anyone here, I'll hold you responsible. Got it. You hear me? Don't feel like a guest because you're not. You're a resource. You're an asset. In the meantime, don't make me regret my sudden outburst of tolerance and generosity. Because if you do, your friend here is going to pay for it. Thank you for your kindness. I'll remember it the next time I'm feeling hungry. <laughs> so, in case you didn't notice the giant thing on my back, I have the Elder Scroll with me. You don't say. Whatever it says, it will have something that can help us stop my father. But, of course, neither of us can read it. So, if we can't read it, who can? Well, the Moth Priests are the only ones I've heard of who can do it. They spend years preparing before they start reading, though. Not that it helps us anyway, because they're all half a continent away. That doesn't help. Cyrodiil. Some Imperial scholar arrived in Skyrim a few days ago. I was staking out the road when I saw him pass by. Maybe that's your Moth Priest. Do you know where he's staying now? No. And I'm not going to waste men looking. We're fighting a war against your kind. And I intend to win it. Gasp! You want to find him? Try talking to anyone who'd meet a traveler. Innkeepers and carriage drivers in the big cities, maybe. But you're on your own. Any idea how you're going to find a moth priest? Yes. Skyrim's a pretty big place. Uh... Where do moth priests actually go? Well, back before I... You know... The College of Winterhold was the first place I'd think to go for any kind of magic or historical thing. The wizards know about all kinds of things that people probably shouldn't know about. I... Well, I'd come with you, but I don't know if I can trust your friend. Let me know if you want me along. You mean Jazargo? One day, I knew. Wait, where is Jazargo? If you want to come along, it has to just be me and you. Um... I kind of Jazargo. If you want to come along, all right, Jazargo. If anyone sneaks up on us, I'll smell them coming. Um, oh, I might not. We will see. It's time for us to part ways, brother. Really, Jazargo was having such fun. Uh, I know, I know. The college, then. See you later, buddy. I'll get you back once you me and Serana are done. Yeah, do you still want me to come with you? Of course. Let's go. A werewolf and a vampire walk into a bar. Tyronimo! Oh, oh, oh god. Okay, well, that, there we go. <laughs> Alright, let me see. Oh my god, the buttons are so weird. Where's Tyronimo? I wanted her to come with me. Where is she? Alright, there goes Poochie. I mean, Tyronimo should be right behind him. See, now this makes more sense. I'm a werewolf, she's a vampire, and then I got an undead dog. Alright. Well, that's gonna go ahead and do it for this video, guys. In the next one, we're definitely gonna continue on right where we left off in finding this moth priest. And we got the lovely Serana behind us to basically have our back throughout this endeavor. So, there's that. I'm actually pretty excited because I really do like Serana. Not to mention, she is pretty damn powerful, man, as a companion. Uh, I don't know who I like better. Realistically speaking, I think I like Jazargo better. But Sarama's pretty badass to say the least. But if you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces. Okay.